You're trying to incite something. Who are you? Did I ask you why you're recording my dogs? Why are you guys filming Now we're worried about dogs' right to privacy out in public. Oh, do you really want to pull that? You guys out here being weird calling people? The rights that you took an oath to protect are weird? Yes, sir. You need more to do. I do need to let all of you know. What's going on? What's it for? Welcome to Impact Media, where we dive headfirst into the intriguing world of First Amendment auditing and expose the realities of a society surrounded by cameras and cluelessness. Get ready for a roller coaster ride as we educate, entertain, and sometimes make you facepalm at the lack of privacy knowledge out there as we remind people that they are always being filmed. Join us as we capture the hilarious reactions of unsuspecting individuals to public filming. Some reactions will make you laugh, while others will leave you questioning the state of education in our tech filled landscape. Brace yourself for eye opening encounters, mind boggling encounters, and a whole lot of did that really just happen moments. Get ready to laugh, cringe, and most importantly, learn about your rights in a world where even your cup of coffee might be watching you. Welcome to a channel where we expose the absurdities one camera at a time. And never forget to please take a second and like this video so the YouTube algorithm bots can share this far and wide. All right, guys, we are here in beautiful Coronado again. We missed the post office when we were here last time, so we're going to go ahead and uh, take care of that today. I do have the updated post for seven here. Excuse me. Two steps. Okay. Two steps. So you got the feel of it. Because the box was closed. Why? Because you paid with you. I, I think I wrote a check and everything. Really? I didn't even have to. I didn't even request I lost my keys. I thought it was the whole mess up. Really. I think I put a key. Did you write any other steps today? I don't know. This is the original key. Right, you remember? So that'll be this. Yeah. Anything else that I can copy? Are you filming? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. And your address? For what? We just we make video about the post office. Why do you ask for? Just wait. The company we work with. Yes. We don't disclose that while we're working. Yes. Okay. And your is under your name? Sounds very mysterious. Um, okay, so I have a question to ask you. I have some Valentine's, so it's kinda late. What's the best way to mail them? Is it to put them together because there's like two families. You can put them together and put in one priority box for 985. That's what I'm right. waiting. Well, two to three days, depending um, on the location. Where you put um, I don't know. I don't know. Do you mind, I ask? Uh, right. so this is uh, we're just taking some video of the post office. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hey, have Nick come here. Thank you. 
No, no. Go ahead. We're just making video of the post offices. This is Leo, and there's actually a poster right behind my brother over there that says we're allowed to record here. I'm sure there is. I'm sure there is. Have fun now. Coward. As you walk away. <laughs> No, 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 go ahead. You're fine. Thank you. Where are we? Okay, thank you. We'll just take a video of the post office. Why? Because that's what we do. Uh, we don't disclose that while we're working. <laughs> All in all, over 100 people came into the post office without bothering to look at us twice. Only a small, minuscule number of people bothered to ask us any questions. Why are you guys filming? Uh, we're just taking a video of the post office. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing? We're just taking a video of the post office. Taking what? Just taking a video of the post office. Excuse me. Yep. I get in this box. Sorry, yep. When people say that we antagonize or that we are there to intimidate or bother people, over 90 people at least came through the post office without feeling either of those things. Just the post office. What's it for? 
we don't disclose that while we're working. Okay, a little weird though that you're filming something in here without their permission, right? That's you're in. Weird. You're in public. Do you guys know this stuff? You're fine. Um, if you just knock on the counter, people have been just knocking on the counter and they come up. We even <laughs> work to engage in a positive way, providing help as needed within the post office when we are here. All right, guys, we are giving a rerun to the uh, post office here in Rancho Santa Fe. It's a little half post office. It closes at 1.30, but the lobby stays open. Um, I think it's a 24-hour lobby. The stickers are not on the window anymore, but I'm assuming. So a lady interrupted me while I was filming my last intro for here, saying, oh, we're not going to get good footage. Post office is closing. That's not where I get the footage from on this one. You need more to do. So do you, buddy. video. My finger is bigger. <clears throat> you said fourth amendment? You don't even know the constitution. He's complaining about me exercising our constitutional rights while getting it completely wrong. That's wonderful. It's the Fourth Amendment? Yeah. It's the first. Yeah, we flipped me off in there. Thank you, sir. Oh, he flipped you off too? Yeah. Hey, if you're so proud of yourself, why don't you take your face mask off so people can see what kind of shit's behind it? Aww. You know that That'd be my record. Yeah. You're kind of an idiot, so I don't listen to anything you say. You're kind of a pussy. Says the one leaving. I'm telling you, some of these post offices are ridiculous. Like, that's a repeat person that was on my channel prior. Just, every day. Yeah, not every day. Uh, this is like our third visit in like a month. Oh, is it? Yeah. What do you do? So we do, it's First Amendment auditing of the post office, um, raising awareness that we're always being filmed in public. We do it all over the country. What did that guy say to you? What did he say? Uh, he said, I don't want to be on camera. So I said, okay, then just don't come in public. He said, what did you just say? He said, I don't want to be on camera, don't come in public. There's cameras everywhere. He's like, we'll see about that. And started trying to get a hold of the workers in there. Oh, so Lord. they know we're here. And then I, like, there's a doorbell over there if you want to get a hold of them. Then he just got upset and left. Every day and in every video, there are lots of people that pay no mind to us, pay no attention to us, don't give us a second look, do not find us intimidating, do not find us scary, and do not need to talk down to us for being there. This proves over and over again that it is not an us problem. It is a small percentage of people that feel the need to attack and accost people and demand answers to things that they are not sure about. One thing I noted last time is this place is so filthy. They don't they don't ever clean. Webs. Those aren't even just spider webs. No, I know, but it's like gross. Like, yeah, dude, like they're cobwebs hanging from the ceiling. They do not do their job here. It's not a post office? They close at 1.30. But they don't have a... Um, 
Is that letters? Yeah, I think it's right here. Okay. <laughs> you have a good day. You too. She did not find us intimidating, harassing, or scary in any form. In fact, I would venture to say that she found us very helpful. These young ladies greeted us and went about their day. Yeah. Hold on, I gotta get the door for this person. Thank you. Yeah. Are you leaving? You taking off? I'll open it for you. Thank you. Have a good day, buddy. Post office. No. <laughs> that was about the gas station. <laughs> you have a good day, buddy. Thank you. They're closed. Are they? Yeah. Oh, because it's... After 1.30. We will soon be accosted by several people back to back who claim that we are intimidating, we are scary, we are here for nefarious reasons, and because of this, I wanted to show you all of the people that really did not care about our existence, the people that found us helpful, the people that were kind to us. So when people say or claim falsely that we are here to intimidate, we are here to create chaos, we are here just for reactions, this is not the case. The reactions come to us and the reactions are given to us by the people that choose to react to us in a negative way when there is a very contrary way to act towards us, which these people have shown and displayed very wonderfully. <laughs> we just take video of the post office. You have a good day, man. Huh? You have a good day. Keep in mind, earlier you saw at least one or two people who were wearing a mask and nobody demanded that they show their faces or remove their mask. In fact, we see in all of our videos that some people wear masks with their sunglasses, with their hats, and nobody is yelling, accosting, or demanding they remove them. You're in public, ma'am. But I'm not. I didn't give you permission to record me. Okay, you're in public. So? We can record anything we can see in public. Like, get a so I've noticed something about this neighborhood. Out of everybody that's come in here, about half of them have not touched the door uh, or the door handle. They either pull their sleeves down, open it that way, use their fingers to pry open the wood part um, so they're not touching the populated area um, where everyone else touches. Uh, so it is a very germaphobe um, situation here.
What's going on? Oh, we're just taking a video of the post office. Why? For fun. Okay. A mask? <laughs> no, we're just filming the post office. You're filming what? The post office. <laughs> Is there a celebrity here? <laughs> Waiting all day for you to show up. Yeah. You have a good day. Okay. The sheriff. Yay. Please be the same one. He just waved at me. So guys, no, Hello. What are you guys up to? Just filming. Okay, cool. Everything all right? You guys need anything? Oh, no, we're we all are good. definitely we're good. good. We're definitely good. Okay. You guys out here being weird filming people? You say being weird? Yeah. Are you saying if the, you're gonna... the, rights, <laughs> okay. the rights that you took an oath to protect are weird? Yes. Are you guys okay? You're We're saying, good, you're but saying, okay. I don't like the language you're using. Our rights are weird that you took an oath to protect. How you doing, man? Uh, can I get name and badge Actually, numbers yeah. again? Can I get name and badge number from you, sir? Well, we need a name and badge number. <laughs> Officer, how's everything? It was, it was great yeah. until he started yeah. calling us weird. So glad you think our rights are weird. Yeah. I've, I've been professional with you, right? He came up, you know. Take care. You too, man. See, one good sheriff, one bad one. Okay. And I'm glad I got that on video. Was it, he's the one who came out last time. Right? Yeah, he yeah, was really he's, nice. He's super cool. That guy it said our rights are weird. Though. Yeah. <laughs> so she apparently is the one that called and was getting really frustrated that the sheriff left without arresting us. So apparently she's the one that called the cops. Stop that! Stop it! So she called the sheriff. I didn't know she was still, I didn't know she was still sitting there. I don't know if she was still sitting there. Oh, we're just taking a video of the post office in the surrounding area. For fun. For fun. For fun. Yeah. He's trying to close this one down? No, but look at all he's cut out in the past five years. Very true. I've noticed. So we, one of the things we do video on is we, the disarray. And I mean, this place, the inside of here is so disgusting and filthy. Nope. I don't understand it. We're supposed to, we've actually been here a couple times, posted a couple of videos about it. So. Well, he's, I'm from Philadelphia. Like, yeah, and they actually yeah. destroyed uh, sorting machines uh, four or five years ago. And all of the, what well, used to go through the post office, I read, goes to his company that used to be there. Wow, so I didn't know that. Yeah, that too. You have a good day, ma'am. Uh, she just, it, it, she said it's not as bad as it used to be. Oh, the this one. It's cleaner than it used to be. It used to be worse? Dang. And this one's kind of gross, yeah, bro. It's pretty bad already. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to go back inside. Everyone went in that door. Stop that! Stop it! Yeah. yeah. I was like, what the hell? <laughs> Oh no, that's not good. That bell is actually closed right now. It's broken? Uh, they turned it off at 1.30. Um, I would put it just inside the... Yeah. They might answer. But if not, just put it in the uh, the deposit box right there. Oh, uh, yeah.
Yep. Yeah. We've noticed that a lot of the employees are. It's a lot of the people that got complacent in the jobs. So, like, after, like, seven years, they can't fire them. So the ones that are have reached that, you know, it's not tenure because that's teacher word, but it's kind of the same idea. The ones that have reached that point tend to just stop caring. <laughs> now, and, the only one I really knew was, whoever she was, worked behind the window. She retired. She'd been here for years, yeah. I guess. But, Some of the supervisors are great, but there's a lot of them that, that really aren't. Cost them more to return them than to actually just deliver them. So it's. inside of a hallmark oh, yeah. and they have it the, before, then moved away from yeah back so they have they have the one in the hallmark is be right. like yeah. the line goes out the door every day yeah. and they got one person in there at a time basically i haven't seen that so much during the holidays but when we lived here the first time in 2002 yeah um i couldn't find a post office and i thought well it used to be such a military area i guess they're afraid of blowing up mailboxes oh yeah so i found the hallmark but then the main post office there you wouldn't even know it was there oh yeah yeah the sign is like yep i mean what's with that oh well, i don't know there's no perfection anywhere but this is ridiculous yeah a little bit yeah. i'm wondering why this location closes at 1 30 because it's busy up yeah, until like used yeah the window used to be open until 3 or 3 30 yeah. it closes at 1 30 on Saturday. So if you're a working mother with kids in sports, I guess you never come to the post office. Right. But yeah, it's just, it's, it's, it's crazy because, it, you know, we're here all afternoon and it's busy in and out the whole time. So it's, we don't understand it. But. Pay over $200 a year for my mailbox. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the keys and a necklace. Yeah, I, I, no, I just tried. Nobody's answering the door. So. Yeah, I saw them come in and put it there and trying to find the video of who set it down. Oh, that'll be helpful. Yeah, but not really, because the keys don't belong to them. So they'll put it down. Oh, I don't know. I think this is someone's car key or house key or something. It can't be a car key. Well, you got video of, you got video of them putting it down or no? This is a mailbox key. And these look like, that's a house key. That's a house key. This belongs to another car, I guess, but it's somebody's. Her husband or this car. Mm -hmm. No, this car. Well, it's like a house key. Not, house. not too long from now, they're going to come out and grab these orange bins, so we'll let them know. <laughs> yeah, they should have them back there. So somebody yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like no, absolutely. Yeah, I, don't I, think, I saw someone put, I saw who put them down, I just didn't get it on video. Dang. Oh, you uh, saw who put them on the counter? Oh, yeah. I, just, oh. I didn't get it on video. Yep, thank you. Uh, we're waiting for them to come back and retrieve them. Yeah. <laughs> you have a good day, man. Yep. We just filmed the post offices, kind of, you know, the condition that they're in, how they operate. This one's sad. sad <laughs> <laughs> That's what she was. She was just going on a whole rant about how horrible oh, it's I can become. Join in. I can do carbon yeah, they just don't care about this one anymore. Apparently, they. I've seen some that are. I mean, they're they're building massive, beautiful 
post offices up in like North County and stuff, and then down here is just like yeah, complete and disarray. All of their banks when they closed down the one right around the corner, mm -hmm. um, so parking sucks. And uh, but yeah, you know, I mean, these colors are like the eighties. Yeah. And yeah, trip. Anyway, good luck. Yeah. No, absolutely. We hope uh, you know somebody pays attention to. Something around there. Yeah. I mean, the floors are falling apart. I mean, the, the, the cobwebs are, I mean, it's just, it's gross. This place hasn't give, been given a cleaning in ages. Yeah, that's true. That is so true. Yeah. And people know it too. I've been looking at like half the people that enter the doors cover up their hands just to grab the door handles. And stuff. <laughs> right? That's funny. There's holes in the wall. Yeah. Not in public. Not in public, but I mean, why if you don't want to be filmed, you, you can just step over a few feet. I will step over, but why is it filming? Just take a video. For what? The post office. Yeah, just at the post office. They're closed. They're closed, man. Oh, they're closed? Yeah, 130. They decided they don't need to stay open, <laughs> which is weird because this is like one of the busier locations after 1.30. That's a sick car. Porsche. I like this guy's Porsche. I like the red roof, the white. This is really clean. Really well done on that one. Not a huge fan of Porsches either, but um, probably because I'm mostly too tall for him. There's no way I could comfortably drive that one. We, gotta, we, we need to order some masks on Amazon, like some presidential masks, and then have the president like freak out on each other's videos mm -hmm. while wearing the presidential masks. <laughs> That's the lady. The lady. The one that, that yeah. What I mean. The one that was freaking out on us inside. Oh, uh, I thought you were talking about the penis lady. Oh, no, that would have been funny. Was, yeah, no, that was funny. <laughs> but how funny would that be to just kind of act out some Karen situations on there. Yeah. <laughs> I think the I think people would like that. Oh, surprise. A uh, Range Rover. Oh wait, look. Uh Range Rover. <laughs> Range Rover. Range Rover. Four door Porsche. <laughs> Literally all that comes to this post office of Porsches is usually that. The four doors. The, I don't know. I don't like the four door Porsche, man. Oh, the 911s are way for the Boxster.
Dun, 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 dun. I got the Home Alone theme song stuck in my head. You just gotta push it, man. I mean, that's, that's fine too. Yeah. We just filmed the activity in a post office. For the who? What's that? For who? For fun. For fun? Yep. Well, I don't like having my picture taken. You're in public, ma'am. Yeah, you have, I know, a, you have to take it about 70 times a day. I think it's, I think it's kind of rude. I wouldn't sit in yeah. front of your house and take your picture. I'm not in front of your house, ma'am. You house. could be. But we're not. Oh, you guys filming? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How you doing? What are you filming? We just do, we do videos in the post office. We've been waiting all day for you, man. <laughs> what? They're not open. Are they not? One thirty. they right. closed no, it. No. See? You have more than one function. <laughs> you have a good day, buddy. I'm so excited. I have more than one function. Yeah. Oh, yeah, for sure. <laughs> you just filmed the activity at the post office. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Exciting. Oh, always. You have a good day, ma'am. Now, did she look scared, intimidated, frightened, agitated by anything that we were doing or by our presence? No. I need to bring them some WD-40 for these doors, though, because they're driving me bat crap crazy. What's that? Camera. How you doing, buddy? I like the hat, man. Ah, <laughs> oh, we do a video of the post office interactions we have, things like that. Take a video of the post office and the ongoings. Oh, she's calling the sheriff.
They just filmed the post office and the ongoings and interactions that we have. Is that legal? Yeah. Yeah. We have we actually have written permission from the post office. Really? Yep. There's no privacy in public, man. Yeah. That's what we're here for, to desensitize people to that. She's calling. Yeah. We're educating the public, reminding them that you're constantly fil filmed when you're out in public. And so we use it as a tool to educate and remind people that. And then we're out here protecting our First Amendment rights, and things like that, too. They're not going to respond. They turned off the bail at one thirty. You have a good day. You too. <laughs> okay, I'll give her that one. I scared her. Uh, we just filmed the ongoings of some post offices that have received a bunch of complaints and disseminate the information and you're the first one that we've talked to today to say that <laughs> everybody else has got a laundry list yeah that's that is very true <laughs> Yeah. I love your accent, though. Well, good luck. Yeah, you have a wonderful day. Take care, bye. Yeah. All right, guys, we got some beautiful keys here left at the Rancho Santa Fe. It looks like somebody's house alarm, uh, you know, entry, some keys. Now, there is something on this. <laughs> um... If you guys know what that item is and this happens to belong to you, email us at impactmedia at gmail.com and I'll tell you where in the post office I hit it. Whoa. Uh, They're close. One thirty. Yep. Kind of pain in the butt. I just filmed the happenings at the post offices that receive the lowest stars on Google and stuff. So. Oh. Because they're only open for like an hour. <laughs> right? <laughs> you have a good day, buddy. They're closed, man. What are you guys doing? 
Uh, we just filmed the ongoings of post offices that have lower reviews and yeah. We all know why you guys are here. Okay. Oh, no, yeah, good. <laughs> what are you guys doing? I uh, just take video of the post office, the ongoings around it. Why? For fun. Well, you look like you're kind of snooping around with masks on. All right. For fun? Yep. Really? There's something illegal you want to do. That's illegal. <laughs> but I didn't give you permission to take photographs of me. You're in public. public space. That's nice. You ain't gonna do shit, dude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you ain't gonna do shit either. I don't understand. I'm not that. the one that tried to pretend I was. Oh, yeah, you were. Uh huh. You guys must have been voting for fighters. 7XHM086. I got that on camera, fool. Oh, do you really want to pull that? What are you doing? Why? We filmed the ongoings at the post office. Why are you making a video? Because we can. <laughs> it's our First Amendment, right? Do we owe yeah. you an explanation? I can't hear you. What happened? We're just taking a video. I don't want to. You're in public, man. Even the post office is recording you. What are you doing now? What's that? What are you doing now? Do you want me to come and explain it? You, I mean, you have a mask on. Okay. But do you want me to come and explain it to you? No, just talk to me. I'm not going to yell it. What's that? Who are you? I'm the guy videotaping the post office. What's that? What are you doing uh, for myself. We disseminate. We disseminate news to the public. This lady's. I don't think you're allowed. To... Oh yeah, we... it's our First Amendment right. So the, that, the right to privacy is actually not guaranteed in the Constitution. That's your First Amendment right. Go ahead. There is no Constitution Amendment for privacy. That's a nice truck. That thing's beautiful. Never seen a day of the dirt, but looks nice. I uh, just videotape in the post office. Why? What's that? Why? Why not? Well, that concerns me. Why is it concerning? Uh, my wife was just here and said that you guys made her very uncomfortable. That, that's okay, not on okay, us, though. So the, onus is, so the onus is not on me to provide comfort to other people's wives. I don't know what that is. Okay. I don't know what you're up to. I mean, if he wants me to provide comfort to his wife, I mean, that's a different conversation. <laughs> I'm just doing a whole video about the parking. I literally can just make a video about how bad people park and slam into curbs at the well, bottom of their cars. You get, you, like, look at this. She's halfway on the no parking side of the, the, the handicap spot. Dude, they all do it on this spot. Like, nobody knows how to... Like, that, that, that's the spot, so you able to get like walk over step in. so he, he's doing this so we can't record <laughs> they're not open anymore they closed at 1 30. Okay. all right
<laughs> Nobody can get the parking spots, bro. Nobody. Not even in this little Not even in this little car. I don't know what I just ran into, that hurt. <laughs> it was sat in the magazine stand. There you go, babe. I'll hold it for you if you want. Oh, sorry. I can, I can carry you it. sure? Yeah, thanks. All right. That's only when I got to empty out the whole box. <laughs> You're all good. Are you leaving or are you going to the counter? Uh, I'm going to the car. Perfect, perfect. What are you guys doing with the cameras? Uh, we just disseminate, you know, the operation of post offices, uh, our interactions with people, and here? the condition that the post offices are in. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Lots of fun. You have a good day. Likewise. Do you want your box? No, sir. Oh, okay. Oh my god, bro. Who can't park. The parking thing here is an epidemic. <laughs> hey, you guys are weird. All right. We're just out here rating people's parking jobs. Come on, let me show you. Yours is yeah. about a four out of ten. <laughs> <laughs> and the only reason I don't move it right now is that I know that nobody's going to be parking in that spot. Isn't that god awful? I agree with you. Yeah. I totally agree with you. <laughs> and there are people worse than I am. <laughs> She admitted it. I turned her around real quick. I was literally about to say the same thing to her. <laughs> Nobody cares about the handicap space here. Every car that was pulled up has blocked either the van portion or the actual parking spot. And one lady said, ah, oh, nobody parks there anyways. Yeah, because it's always blocked. <laughs> I had to ask, what does the back of the hoodie say? Is it crusade or cursed? What's that? The back of the hoodie. Oh, cursed, not cursed, crossed. Crossed, no. okay. <laughs> Music festival. I'm anti curse. I, I got the life of Christ in me, brother. <laughs> you have a good day. <laughs> and pop top like this? And about this size? Give me some Yeah, I'm gonna get back. Bye, puppy! What's that? Can I ask you why you're recording my dogs? Am I not allowed to record the puppy? I'm just asking you okay. why you're... I just got a shot of the puppy. Okay. okay. Why are you here? Why? That's a whole different question, but I'm not... You, you kind of came out a little aggressive, but I'm going to... I'm, I'm not going to answer that right now. Okay. Well, you're recording my vehicle. You parked dog. it out in public. I know. I'm okay. Just curious what you're doing. And there's a puppy, and I was saying, hey, cute puppy. Like, Jesus Christ, lady. Lose it a little bit. I just got yelled at for taking pictures of a dog. So now the dogs have right to privacy in public. I joke about this right now, but I have to get into this. As people begin expecting privacy out in public, it is becoming a very slippery slope. Now we're worried about dogs' right to privacy out in public. Think about that for just a second. 
And now let all the haters chime in and explain why this is not absolutely needed. Oh, we're just taking videos of the post office. Videos of people walking in? Yep. Otherwise, it's just a building. We gotta get, we gotta get you, you guys coming in and out. Or we just make travel videos and stuff. And a handsome man like yourself, man. It looks like, you know, you guys got your faces covered. And... It looks like or we do? No, it, said it just looks funny. You guys right. got your faces covered, but what's the reason for that? Multiple reasons, but it would take all day to get into that. But it's creating your own privacy in public. And, you know, how if you want privacy in public, you got to create it yourself. It's a whole, yeah. He, did, he didn't actually want the answer, so I just gave him the, the, the rundown. Yeah. Another one they can't park, guys. They only have these Look at that. I, I swear, like, we should, start putting a, we should start putting a poll on whether or not people can park. No, right? Let's, we should have a vote. A vote. What does that actually do? What's that? What you have. Recording? Yeah. It takes video. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Another one. Another, see? Straight oh up. God. Straight up, bro. The next person to park <laughs> Still doesn't know how to park. He's very interesting. What are you doing? I'm just taking a video. What? Uh, people parking and missing the lines. Yeah, you did a, you did a, <laughs> you did a good job. You don't have my permission to film me, man. You're in public. And you parked in the handicap spot. You guys are a waste of time. All right. What's that? Because we want to film? It's our First Amendment right to film. Hey, you're practicing it too. Good job. First Amendment myself. Okay. I actually sponsored Les Celeste to come here to you, speak. You sponsored who? Left Whatever you say, sir. The big First Amendment. All right. You too. So, why are you covering your face? Why are you covering your face? Okay, same. Yeah. Yes, sir. Thank you. Got a name? No. Don't have a name. Nope. Do you guys have a name? I'm not going to give you my name. Oh, we got two pleasant men in here. Come on, I thought you were, um, yeah, I thought you guys were brave. Time. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Don't, sir? don't you want to give us a name? Oh, no, I would not like to. How about, what's your jacket? Fly Emirates, huh? Arsenal. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Well, thanks. Good luck with everything. Annoying people pretty much. Just like you are. We left you. We left you alone. You approached us first. Okay, quick. Somebody's Excuse me. Yep. You take a picture of me. A video okay. of everybody coming in and out. Oh. Smart way to do it is this guy. He backed in. That's smart. Why are you doing that? What's that? Why are you doing that? Why am I doing what? Videotaping? Yeah. I'm making video. Well, I don't really give you my permission. You're in public, ma'am. I, I don't have to give my permission in public? No. Not in public. Okay. Not in public. You don't want to just like sort of explain to people so they kind of know so what's going on? So it depends on how they ask and how they approach it. I did ask why you were doing it. So. But you, it's how you present that question. Okay. How are you, why are you, what's the video about? Well, now you're just being condescending about it. I'm just curious. Okay. We just make video. 
we disseminate the ongoings of the post office. Who are you? I'm not going to share where, who we're working for. Okay. Bye. You have a good day. To clarify, guys, there's like th four doors. Four doors for... She saw us filming and then cut right to my door right in front of my camera. So I don't want to hear the comments like, ooh, he was in his face. He was in her face. I actually wasn't. I haven't moved. I've stood still. The only thing I moved is my camera. Um, but she has multiple doors to choose from so you know i think she she wanted to get a you know a little bit nosy which is fine um but do it a little bit nicer if you're gonna be nosy do it a little nicer i have no problem sharing what we're out here for and educating people but you gotta you gotta give some respect to get it okay. all right guys we got another two spotters what's that we're just taking video what's i can barely hear you What's that? Of what? Just the post office and comings and goings. And why do you have masks on your face? That's a whole different conversation. <laughs> What's that? What are you guys recording? Well, we were recording over there, just the post office and the ongoings, but she wanted to talk about it. Oh. Uh, and where are these videos going? We don't inform people of that right while we're working I'm not gonna share that we don't disclose that information while we're working what's that so everybody filming in public is shady I mean yeah kind of okay so you don't need to ask permission. So if you're at Disneyland, you stop everybody around you and ask permission when you're taking photos and videos. Well, no, but I don't take videos of like other people. How do you not? They're in the background. I guarantee of every one of your pictures. Okay, I'm not trying to cause problems, but you don't. I mean, like you can see how this seems like you know, like it's 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 like so it's actually the opposite. Yeah. So it, we're actually defending people's rights by doing this. It is our right to make our own privacy in public and to record in public. So there is no right to privacy. If you want privacy, it's in your house. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. I, I just, it just seems, it's just like, like you've got stuff strapped to you and it's just, it's just alarming. My daughter's at dance, so I just want so to make sure. So my like, battery pack and then my water. And my phones and my wallet, yeah. Yeah. And all I have is a little hat for my cats. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Well, I, it's also like sort of strange how like you act like it wouldn't be sort of upsetting to see some men with masks on like filming things. Like the fact that you were confrontational just seems. Well, no, I, I'm not being confrontational at all. Well, again, I just don't. Argumentative, I, whatever you want to call it's it. It's not that. It's just we don't disclose everything just because somebody asks for it. Yeah. So I mean, if if you're sitting out in public doing whatever you're doing, I walk up and say, "Why are you wearing those glasses? Or why are you wearing the watch? Or who are you talking to on your phone? Are you going to give me the answers to those questions?" No, that's but that's a totally different scenario. But it's not. But it's not. I mean, oh, at, but it is. Okay. I mean, those these are very like things you see often, but like. I see people guys, filming all the time. But not in threes, all wearing masks mm -hmm. with like bags all over them. I, right? I'm the I only just, one that has I the bags. I just wanted to approach you right. because I'm trying to make sure that there's like safe, there's this is safety. Mm -hmm. I would hope that anytime somebody sees something yeah. out of the ordinary, yeah. that they would not just ignore it because that's okay. how unsafe things happen. All right. So, so that's and that's I'm not trying to like no no and, and no no and because you've been mostly respectful about it, which is why I've been sharing everything with you. So yeah, okay, well, do your thing. <laughs> <laughs> See, another young lady who put you know parked in the handicapped spot. Like everyone was saying, oh, nobody uses it. Yeah, they do. Yeah, I've seen so many people in that spot today. Yeah. Am I at channel two or at channel four? <laughs> You're on channel, channel YouTube. Zero. <laughs> How you doing, buddy? Okay. I'm waiting all day for you to come by. 
they're closed. They close at 1.30 here. What are you guys doing? Uh, we just take video of the post office, the ongoings, people coming and going and disseminate it. Are you the one that was talking to the policeman last week out here in the park? Yes. What is the whole purpose of this? So, um, if you sincerely are interested... I'm sincerely okay. interested. So, we do First Amendment auditing. What does that mean? So, it means that we, you know, we have rights in this country, and if you don't use them, you lose them. And so, we kind of test the limits of those rights by filming in public okay. and reminding people that if you want privacy in public, you have to work and create your own privacy like I have. Ah, that's it? That's a lot of it. I mean, I, I can go all day. If you, Why are you in this particular shopping center? We do all of them. I mean, so are you actually taking pictures? Video. Video? Yep. And is there a, a, a place where you put it? So we or disseminate it. With it. We have like nine different channels we disseminate it on. Okay. And what is the purpose of the dissemination? So just, just For example, for me walking to from my car into the post office? <laughs> so it's not necessarily that. So a lot of the boring stuff gets taken out. Um, or time lapse, depending on the length of the video that we end up putting together. Some of it will time lapse it if we have space to fill. Is there anything interesting in this? Oh yeah, I, all the interactions that we have, like the one with yourself. Hello. <laughs> what is he doing? He's the same thing. He should be in school. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I'm 20, I'm 22. <laughs> oh, you're, you're already out of school. Yeah. You should be in graduate school. Yeah. Okay. It's not even worth it nowadays. <laughs> well, you, you could well be right. You could well be right. The price is, I don't know. Anyway, good luck. Yep. First Amendment is good. How about the Second Amendment? So I, we, we do practice 2A, but we can't do that in a federal facility. <laughs> okay. Then we'd get in trouble. All right. What was the policeman here for, though? Um, people call them on us all the time. and They want to know what you're doing with the black mask. Well, not the, well, not, so we, Alex. That was our radio code between my sons and I. He was to use that if there was ever an aggressive gentleman getting up in his face. Hold on, I gotta go. I'm curious what you do. I'm curious, I'm curious what, what you're, you're doing. doing. So what do you guys do? What are you guys videoing? Huh? What are you guys videoing? Oh, I'm just taking a video of the post office. I mean, you you're, you're allowed to do what's, that. What's your you're name? You're allowed to do that. What's your name? I don't well, need to why are you that. videoing everybody coming in and out of the post office? Because it's my First Amendment right. Okay, but what is interest? You're kind of like, it's it's weird, and it's kind of intrusive on people, isn't it? It's not a nice thing yeah, to do to people. The first time okay. the first time you meet people, you're sitting there videoing without their uh, approval, anything. Do you like it? Hey, it's fine. I mean, you're being more intrusive than I am. Then look how not, close Not at all. Not at all. You're the one that's standing here. At this point, my son backs up, as I've instructed him to do, and the gentleman approaches further towards him. Getting all the public here coming in, Look which how is close weird. You came up to me, though. Which is weird. And you've got a mask on, too. Are you trying to hide from something? What are you trying to hide from? People like you. Uh, who, who are people like me? Now you're characterizing me. A hardworking person that works hard and say, provides for a family? Do you work? Do you work? Do you work? Do you work? Do you, uh, yes, I do. do you work? I do work. I'm a business person. What do you do? What do you do? What are you doing here? What, what are you doing, doing here? I'm yeah, actually, yeah. I'm going to get mail. So what, what are, are you, you guys, guys doing? What are you going to get your okay. mail? What are you guys But there's doing? a way to ask and there's a way not to ask. I was having a they're, whole conversation with him. They're, they're doing it. A, <laughs> I just asked the same right. And what do you say? Because he was with a policeman last week. Right. Somebody called and wanted to know what's going on in the parking lot. And so they're, I don't know what they're doing. I mean, it's, it, it feels like harassment is what it feels like. Feels Except like I walk out here and you're harassing like him. Well, I'm showing you, you what you're doing to the you public. Came very okay, good okay. hold on, hold on, hold on. Very, no, no, stop. Very good distance we stand people. in one position. Right. We don't run up to people's faces with the camera like you did. Look, what, what you're doing mean. is wrong, and you guys know. Absolutely not. It is this not. is wrong, what you're doing. It's the first testing amendment. the limits of doing? the First Amendment of the Constitution yeah, is actually not wrong. People? Not is at all. Nice? Not at Are all. you guys being pleasant to society? Are you being a benefit to society? Are you being Absolutely. pleasant? Yes. No, I help no, the society. No. Okay, hold on. I give you, back to the society. Okay. You guys? Get absolutely. Do you get, yes, absolutely. absolutely. And you? Absolutely. Yes, absolutely. How? Tell me your name. I'll tell you everything about me. Tell me about you guys. not going to. Hiding. Not self. You're hiding no, you're right just there. Not you guys are in disguise right now. Is what you mm -hmm. are. You're not trustworthy okay. in disguise, and it's I'll scary.
Scary is very subjective because it is based on personal experiences, perceptions, and emotions. What one person finds scary, another person may find exciting or amusing, which has been proven time and time again with every single one of our videos on how different people react. Scary experiences can vary depending on cultural background, upbringing, and individual fears and anxieties. Additionally, different people have different thresholds for fear and may react differently to the same stimulus. What may be terrifying or scary for one person may not have the same effect on another. The subjectivity of fear allows for a wide range of interpretations and reactions to the things that are considered scary. And for this reason, we cannot be responsible for each individual's perception of what they fear based on what we are doing. For that same reason and understanding, we cannot be held responsible for person's fear over the use of our face masks, which two years ago, everybody was wearing. And even to this day, on many of our videos, people are still wearing hey when i come out and you got a phone yeah, three inches you, from his face that's not polite you have a phone three inches from his face you have work do you work Your actually phone. i get it you're trying to incite something no we're trying to show got you it. what you were doing sir okay so i'm gonna get all right buddy you, you. can do that you can do that all you want and then gonna do i'll figure you guys out we'll, we'll figure out what's going on let's want to get our neck you're such a pleasant man. What are you doing? I'm taking a video. Um, why? We're just filming the ongoings of the post office. Um, are they aware of this? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Do you have a clip to show people that? Yep, it's on the wall. You're looking for the poster seven? Pardon me? You're looking for the poster seven? No, I'm just wondering yeah. where it says that you're going to be doing this. All right. So the rules and regulations of the post office allow us to film for news purposes, which is what we're doing. Really? Yeah. What are you affiliated with? I'm not going to share that right now. Okay. And you're not going to show your faces? Not right now. We're just filming the ongoings of the post office. That's really interesting. Yeah. It looks like she's gonna come take a video of me. Which is fine. I mean, Jesus Christ. That's fine. It's your right to do so. <laughs> you have a good day. You too. No, no, you're fine. You're fine. <laughs> Once again, did she perceive fear and antagonization, or did she make the best of a situation and have fun with us? You want to run and open the door for him, though? Yeah. Uh, let me figure out which one you're going Yeah. <laughs> Uh, looks like he's going for this one. Yeah, go ahead and... It's Stan Lee. How you doing? What's that? Oh, we're just filming the post office and any interactions we have and people coming in and out. And, oh, yeah, lots of fun. Yep, you too, man. Be safe. Oh, that would be so funny. We'll see. Looks like This car is my pet peeve, though. The Mustang, they should not have named the electric Mustang. The Maki, uh uh. Yeah. You waiting for Taylor? Yeah, we've been waiting for you all day. Yeah. <laughs> Taylor Swift's gonna be your <laughs> Again, did he look antagonized or afraid of what we were doing there? Did he fear our masks or our cameras?
All right. So what happened with that one dude? With what one dude? The guy that threw his phone up in your face. Oh, I was just standing right here recording, and he walks up from behind. I turn around, and he just whips his phone up right in my face, asking why I'm recording. <laughs>